Hi everyone, welcome back. In today's video, I will be creating this beautiful brown golden halo eyes and I actually used all the products under the budget of 300 rupees only which makes it quite affordable for all of you out there. So yeah, you can see we can actually create a beautiful full glam makeup look using very affordable products. So if you guys want to know what are the products that I used to create this look and also how I created this look then please continue watching. I'm gonna begin with some skincare. So firstly, I will be washing my face with the Dermacos 2% Sika Glow Daily Face Wash. During summers, my skin becomes very dull and dehydrated and to get that beautiful glow back to my skin, uh, I like to use something which has Sika because Sika is a great, great ingredient to treat that because it has great moisturizing properties. It helps in the synthesis of hyaluronic acid and provides dewy and glowy skin. So I'm firstly just gonna wash my face with this face wash i'm just gonna rub this all over my face for about 30 to 40 seconds and then i'm just gonna wash it off you can clearly see my skin is really nicely clean but it is not at all dry you can still see a really nice glow on my face now the next step would be applying a serum and for that i will be applying the dermacos 10 percent sika glow face serum the consistency of this serum is very thin and very liquidy this gets absorbed very very quickly into the skin and this feels very very lightweight and provides such a beautiful glow to my face uh, I'm just uh, gonna dab this and you know press this into my skin the best part about this serum is that this doesn't make my skin uh, greasy or sticky that is something which I hate especially during summers because because of the humidity and everything uh, my face becomes very uh, you know sticky and I just don't like the products uh, which makes my face even more oily or you know tacky but this product is just so lightweight and gets absorbed very very quickly into the skin once the serum is nicely absorbed into my skin the final final step would be applying a moisturizer and for that I will be applying this 5% Sika Glow Daily Face Moisturizer. This moisturizer is again very lightweight and provides such a beautiful glow to my face. I like to apply this on those days where my skin is extremely extremely dry and I see you know dry patches on my face. I like to apply this moisturizer. This gives me the instant glow on my face uh, and makes my skin extremely soft and very very dewy. The combination of these three products is working great for me and you can actually apply these products every day in your skincare routine but if you're applying this during your daytime make sure to apply a good sunscreen and also do a patch test before applying these all over your face. So yeah, if you want to get these products, you can actually use my coupon code which is right now on the screen and you will get 20% off on the Dermaco's website. Also, every time you buy from them, Dermaco will link your order to a child that they help educate along with Bhumi. So they are actually planning to help 10,000 plus students across the year which is a great initiative and we all should support that. So yeah, if you guys want to get these products, I will be leaving the details and the links in the description box below. So do not forget to check that out. Now let's move on to the makeup part. So firstly, I will be applying a primer and for that I will be taking this Inside 3-in-1 Primer. This is a silicone based primer and this blurs your pores completely and gives a really nice soft uh, finish to the skin and the foundation sits very beautifully on top of this primer. Normally a silicone based primer makes your skin quite matte and dry but this is not the case with this particular primer. This blurs your pores but keeps the moisture locked into the skin and that's why I really really like this primer. This is quite affordable and actually a great primer in the budget. So I will just be applying this on the areas where I have pores and also I will be applying this uh, on my smile lines. This also blurs any kind of fine lines or smile lines, anything this which is there on your face, just apply it over there and it's just gonna make everything very smooth and really nice. For foundation, I will be taking this Insight Ultra Thin Second Skin Foundation. This is actually a very recent uh, find for me. I would say this is a great, great foundation. The consistency of this is very liquidy, so it's actually very easy to apply this foundation. You can use a brush 
or a beauty blender to apply this foundation you can see how beautifully and how easily this blends with uh, with the help of a brush if you use a you know beauty blender the beauty blender might soak up a lot of amount of foundation and that's why i really like to use this foundation with the help of a brush and uh, this the finish of this foundation is not super dewy but not super matte at the same time so this would work for all skin type if you have dry combination or even oily skin uh, if you like you can actually build this foundation up at the same time now for concealer i will be taking this mars seal the deal concealer this concealer is a great concealer uh, i would say this is a medium coverage concealer but if you like you can actually build it up so i will just be applying this uh, close to my eyes my inner corners because that's where i have quite a lot of darkness or you can say dark circles and this actually really nicely cancels out the dark circles uh, on my face and this also blends very very easily you just need to work uh, a little fast with this concealer because this dries pretty quickly uh, but yeah you can use a beauty blender or a brush to you know blend this out this gives a really nice finish to the face next step would be contouring and highlighting my face before setting my face because i will be using a cream product and this one is from inside so firstly i will just be applying this uh, on the areas where i want my face to be look you know a little more chiseled so i will just be applying this on my cheekbones little bit on my forehead because i want to cut down and make my forehead look a little smaller because i have a bigger forehead and then i will be just you know blending it out with the help of a beauty blender if you like you can use a brush but i personally like to use a beauty blender because this blends so so easily with the help of a beauty blender and uh, you know your beauty blender has foundation left on it so when you blend it uh, with the same beauty blender it gives more seamless and more beautiful finish so yeah i will just be uh, pushing the contour uh, into my hairline so there's no harsh line harsh brown line on my forehead I will also be contouring my nose with the same stick. I'm just going to draw two lines very close to each other and then I will again be blending it out with the help of a beauty blender. You can actually use your fingers as well if you like uh, to, you know, blend your nose contour. You can see how easily this is getting blended now the next step is to highlight and i'm gonna use the same stick the other side of the stick is a highlighter and i will just be uh, highlighting the you know highest points on my face like my tip of my nose the bridge of my nose and also my cheekbone this uh, stick is a great product you guys i would say this blends very very beautifully and this is actually great product in budget the blendability is beautiful the pigmentation is just so so great the highlighter also is so so beautiful it is a highlighter for your very natural looks if you are someone who likes blinding highlighters this is definitely not the one this is perfect for your everyday or your very natural makeup looks Now that all my cream products are really nicely applied, I'm gonna set everything into place and for that I will be taking this Maybelline New York Fit Me Compact Powder. Firstly, I will just be setting my under eyes because that is the area which tends to crease very very quickly on my face. So I will just be taking the powder and pressing that under my eyes and you can see how beautifully and how instantly this you know mattifies that area but this doesn't you know make my skin look very very dry and then i'm just gonna press uh, the powder all over my face just a little bit not too much if you have oily skin you want to make sure that you apply the powder all over your face very very nicely now the next step is to apply a blush and i'm applying this beautiful beautiful shade from ny bay this whole range is so great from NY Bay but particularly this particular shade is just so so beautiful these uh, blushes are extremely extremely affordable and the quality is just so amazing you guys I mean you can actually compare it with some expensive uh, you know blushes because the quality is that good the blendability is amazing and also the pigmentation is insane so you want to work with this very very carefully just take very little amount of the blush dust off the excess and then uh, you know apply this on your face 
now the next step would be filling in my brows so for that i will be taking this inside cosmetics eyebrow pencil this is a really nice uh, product to use you guys for your brows it is a little uh, pigmented than my liking so that's why i like to use this with very light hand the shade is just so perfect for my brows and this you know applies very very easily the only thing that you want to make sure and you want to keep in your mind that you want to apply this with very light hand because this is a little too uh, pigmented for your brows and the spoolie also is of great quality you can see my brows are looking really really nice and beautiful now for my eyeshadow i will be taking this swiss beauty eyeshadow palette and you guys know how much i love this eyeshadow palette i have actually recommended this so many times uh, before on my channel uh, multiple times and the reason is very clear this is a great great eyeshadow palette and i couldn't find anything better than this under the budget of 300 bucks because this is the perfect palette for your everyday makeup looks and also your party wear makeup looks the mattes are so so really nicely pigmented the blendability also is just so good and uh, the shades are are amazing i mean this is the palette that you need to have in your kit no matter what so i will be creating a halo eye beautiful brown halo eye with this palette and uh, this is a palette that you can create multiple everyday makeup looks and uh, also party wear makeup looks so firstly i've applied a really nice uh, orangish brown shade on my crease and blended it out very very nicely with my light hand and then I took the darkest brown shade from the palette and I'm just gonna put that on the inner corner and also on the outer corner of my eyes and I'm just gonna connect it uh, you know on the crease and you can see the pigmentation of this product once this shade is nicely blended, I'm going to take this beautiful shimmery shade from the palette with my finger only and I'm just going to put this uh, just on the middle part of my eyelid and you can see how beautiful this shade is. It is also again very very pigmented but there's no fallout whatsoever. So after that I will be applying the same shade that I applied on my lid close to my lower lash line. The final step for my eyes is to apply a mascara and for that I will be applying this Mars mascara that again is something which I have uh, recommended so many times on my channel because this mascara is so good you guys this gives really nice length to your lashes separates your lashes gives a uh, good volume and this just looks so so beautiful this is exactly what I want from a mascara this is a great great mascara looks absolutely stunning this is not a waterproof mascara and that's why I really like to use this for my everyday makeup looks as well the final final step is to do my lips and for that I will be applying a lip liner firstly and I'm using the Wet n Wild lip liner in the shade Chestnut uh, you guys already know if I'm applying a nude lipstick this is a lip liner that I literally go for every single time this is my if, uh, you know all time favorite lip liner so I will just be applying this uh, on my you know lips and then for lipstick I will be taking this NYB lipstick again a gorgeous gorgeous nude lipstick the formula is just stunning this feels very very lightweight on the lips and the shade is something that i am totally in love with all right you guys this is the finished look and you can see how beautiful this look has turned out so yeah i really hope you guys found this video helpful and also enjoyed watching this if you did then make sure to subscribe to my channel and also hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my future videos coming your way and yeah i will see you guys very very soon in my next video till then stay safe stay at home i love you guys all so much bye